When a tourist embarked on a solitary expedition in Africa, he inevitably encountered something that would profoundly alter the course of his life. Damien Venero, aged 44, observed an unusual sight atop an elephant's back. Upon closer inspection, this belief overwhelmed him. The pressing question remained, would Damien manage to contact the police promptly upon obtaining the confirmation he sought? With a helicopter in the sky and tourist Damien, along with his guide and ground vehicle, they pursued the elephant herd with utmost haste. If Damien's initial observation held true, time was of the essence. Eventually, they rediscovered the herd at a remote water basin, far from civilization. Caution became paramount as they aimed not to startle the animals. Fortunately, Damien realized that they had arrived just in the nick of time, or so it seemed. With unwavering certainty in what he had witnessed, he promptly dialed the police, recognizing the need for assistance in this endeavor. Perhaps there was no other recourse. But what had Damien glimpsed among the elephants? Why did the involvement of the police become necessary, and could they successfully conclude this mission? Elephants are thought to have a mystical character, a kind of intelligence that we as humans hardly know anything about yet. Since they are the world's largest mammals on land, most people see the animals as gentle giants. And yet, the locals that have to deal with elephants on a regular basis are far more aware of the potential danger they possess. A group of elephants had been repeatedly causing havoc in South Africa for a while now, mainly targeting small villages. Mostly, the group was destroying things around and plundering all the food they could get their trunks on. Apart from the damage they caused, they sometimes were stealing items from the villages as well. In the most recent action, the elephants pulled such a stunt that they actually took something very valuable with them. The infamous herd left the local village devastated. While the villagers had no means of chasing the elephants, it happened at the edge of a rural area with no major cities around, a place at which no authorities felt involved enough that they were going to help them. The villagers needed a miracle, which came to them in the form of a tourist named Damien. Damien is a hard-working millionaire who would plan an exotic solo adventure every few years. It was his lifelong dream to go on a month-long trip alone in the lesser populated areas of southern Africa, and thus he had been planning this for quite some time. He was heading for the outskirts of the African plains. While most people opt to go for such a safari by means of a four-wheel drive, Damien went for another option. Perhaps a jeep would get you closer to the animals, but Damien had a clear goal for this month. The millionaire traveler was not completely alone on his mission. He was making the personal helicopter journey with a local guide. Included in the package was the service for the entire day, meaning that they also had the time to land the helicopter a few times a day to see the animals up close from above. With Damien's aerial perspective and the guide's experience, the animals would be fairly easy to find. Soon enough, they found a large and active herd of elephants. Damien was excited to cross off the first item on his list, bringing him closer to his goal. He took out his 600mm lens and looked at a couple of them in his camera viewfinder when suddenly he saw something else in the herd. There was no doubt in his mind. He had to see this up close. So he immediately instructed the helicopter pilot to bring the machine down at a safe distance. They landed as quickly as possible, but when they did, it appeared there was a problem. The herd was much further away from them than they expected. The tour guide explained to Damien that the herd was already on the move the moment they spotted them from above. Not only was Damien stressed about the situation, but the local guide was visibly tense as well. It turned out to be a difficult wait, as other animals were lurking, and not just any animals. A couple of lions had slowly approached the two after the helicopter had taken off. If the guide had not had a gun with which he could fire a warning shot, who knows how he and Damien could have ended up. Thirty minutes passed before the car finally arrived to pick them up. Was there any point in chasing the herd after they had been stuck here for such a long time? The two weren't sure anymore. Damien decided to turn on the car's radio and attempted to get in contact with the helicopter pilot, hoping that he still had eyes on the elephant herd. To Damien's relief, it did not take more than a couple of seconds to hear someone at the other end of the line. It was the pilot's voice explaining that he had eyes on the herd again and that they were not even that far away. The group had stopped at a small water basin only a few kilometers away. He had more good news to tell. The pilot continued by explaining that, 
as far as he could make out from way up in the sky, the elephants still had something very unusual with them, yet he could not make out exactly what it was. While he was quite sure that it was the same thing that alerted Damien in the first place, Damien's heart started to beat heavily again. They raced as swiftly as their vehicle would allow, desperate to reach their destination. Sometime later, they finally spotted the distant water basin. The safari truck driver suggested parking their vehicle on a flat field behind a tree line, close to the herd, and they promptly followed his advice. This strategic positioning afforded them a somewhat advantageous viewpoint from which to observe the elephants. At long last, Damien had the opportunity to scrutinize the assembly of colossal mammals more closely. He retrieved his backpack and retrieved his monocular. Initially, Damien peered through the trees, searching for the elephant that had caught his attention from the helicopter. Within a matter of seconds, his target came into view, along with the enigmatic object still mounted on the elephant's back. What Damien beheld left him in a state of disbelief. Perched atop the elephant was a young boy. With his newfound certainty, Damien urgently contacted the local police. They swiftly organized a rescue mission, safely recovering the young boy and returning him to the village from which the elephants had taken him. Fortunately, he remained in good health.